Okay, got my Breville juicer here. Now, it's seen some better days. I have to actually tie the lid on because the little bar here is loose and it causes it to have some problems. So we're not going to worry about that too much. I'm going to start out doing some green stuff and uh, it's going to get kind of noisy so you can watch me do this. Um, you'll see, I'll show you each thing I'm going to juice to make this green juice that I'm making first. So let's start out by plugging in the juicer. <laughs> Do. Always hold on to your juicer because it's got a strong motor. You know what I mean? First I'm going to do a whole cucumber. Wow, this is wow. Okay. Now I'm going to do celery. Celery for the salad. Celery yields a lot of juice. It's good for you. Juice and water. Micronutrients. Okay. Now to this, I'm going to add a little thumb of ginger. Half a it doesn't take much. Okay. I think just to balance things out, I'm going to add an apple. Small apple. Sweeten it up a little bit. Maybe two apples. Sweeten it up a little bit. Okay. You know, that was done. That is celery, a thumb of ginger, which is literally about a thumb's worth. Um, a couple of apples and in, and uh, a cucumber. And that's kind of a nice green juice. And here's how it looks as I pour it. Nice and pretty. I'll taste it here in a minute. Oh, that is just perfect. That's the perfect quantity. Okay. All right. Okay, so the green juice is done. Let's rinse this out real quick and we'll get on to the next one. Which will be the carrot juice. Right, let me give it a sip of this. Oh, that's good. That's yummy. Yummy and nutritious. So I bottle that and put it in the fridge, keep it cold. And that'll be my daily green juice for a couple days. I'll let that last a couple days. Alright, now we're getting the good stuff. Pretty simple. You got carrots. Okay, let's do them. Carrots are fun to juice. I love doing carrots because they go fast. Here we go. I always chop the ends off. And if you see any little imperfections, like a little wrinkle or a cut, carve that out because that's where parasites live. You don't want them to get it. No, you do not. so good with the ginger. Alright, so now I made the carrot juice and you saw how that worked. Now see I have this anti-foaming lid and if you can see this, it's one thing cool about the Breville is when I pour all this foam will stay in the top. Although foam is good too, you know, you want to save that too. Okay, so here we go. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Right, the golden red color, the carrot color, the orange. And look, this will yield just exactly one mason jar full, which is perfect. 
Mm. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Got it, guys. That's so good. Alright. So, there we go. Two easy juices to do. The prep time to cut those ends off of those and wash those was about, oh, I don't know, 10 minutes max. Alright, this baby is going into. There we go. I don't want to have carrots in it. This baby is going into the fridge to be used when it gets nice and cold. Mix it down with my green juice. I don't have any refreshing. Oh, I could do that. Drink that one three times a day if I wanted to. And that's that. Now, you take your pulp. I'll show you real quick how this works with the Breville. If you take your pulp out. I'm tired here. <laughs> There's one thing I why I want to get the Breville Juice Pro because the Pro, oh boy, it's a lot of pulp. The Pro has a collector on the side that saves up all the pulp. This stuff is dry, it's almost bone dry. Okay, you can put that in your garden and make nice compost out of it. Notice how it grabbed all the stems and all the stuff I didn't want in my juice and threw it off to the side. So you take this off and, and dump it. It's a little messy for me today, so I'm not going to do that. But take it off, dump it, clean everything up, and you're good to go for the next batch. All right. I'm a little scruffy today. So forgive the extra scruffiness, but you can eat them raw, too. <laughs> That's your juice video for March 9th, 2013. Say goodbye to the bears. The happy bears. Bears drinking wine. Woo! Yummy! Cheers.